you know I'm getting the Halloween vibes you know and it's December we've had we've had Halloween obviously with it being the 31st of October and it's not November now it's December yeah I'm walking up Mucky Lane I am meeting my dad at Blackley Church uh, so he finishes at 9 and it's like 5 past 9 now I feel so weird actually being on Mucky Lane but in the dark and the thing is I went for, I went for a walk earlier this afternoon for like about an hour did, I was not say 3.7 miles I did but the dogs had a pretty good run and well let's be honest they've been knackered all afternoon and I'm not gonna lie so have I so because I've not been out for like five and a half hours they've been sleeping like I have and uh, they've needed the toilet an incredible amount I've literally got layers on like I've got my floor mandy tights on I've got my me twee leggings on I've actually got my me twee thermal top on as well and a jumper <sighs> I've got socks on as well <sighs> I am just stopping every now and then I can actually see really well up here I thought I would have been a bit screwed but because there's no lighting but actually you can see quite well with the lighting that's there and all around it gives quite a good like vision for myself just waiting for dogs to come up that's why I'm being slow if I'm walking up during the day I can just keep walking and like walk behind and see where they are because it's dark I'm not uh, taking any sort of chances at all and it don't take half an hour to get for for me dad to get from his work to the church it don't and yeah the dogs are slowing down because they're getting older so I'm kind of like well the idea of doing the walking is going to be a lot lot less well it's still going to happen but it's going to be less because a couple of years ago they wouldn't have struggled they are struggling now that's the thing so uh, I'm starting to see that aspect now they're just not wanting to really go walking as much now it's just like when I'm out walking they're like, oh, do I have to? That's just it's kind of nice just to come here. I mean, there was, there would have been the quicker way of going from Victoria Road up the hill here. I don't know why I'm pointing because you can't see me. I actually can all just. Uh, if I forget to them lights, you'll be able to see my hand a bit quick, easier. What I'm doing is just put the dogs on the lead. But they don't seem very interested in coming. This is the thing I was saying, like, like they would have been interested in coming for a walk and they're not that fussed now. Which is kind of sad, because, like, as a dog owner, you want to take your dog's places in, like, and I know this is only, like, five minutes away from home, but, like, that's one. Doing this with one hand. There it is, let's put it in my mouth. I couldn't get it, get it, get the lead on. I've got one on already. Especially as well, it being in the minuses nearly. And I'm not left handed. Oh, God, hang on. Oh! literally you're playing hook a duck with your weaker hand yes 
got it. Oh god. Yeah, the uh, the tired I know, but when you start to show less interest in going for walks, it's like when you get older, you don't want to do as much. Same for dogs. Like if you know, if you get older, you just don't want to do as much. It's kind of like being McDonald's. Like you know, I was getting sick of full time. I was getting tired of it. So what have I done? I'm working less. Yes, I'm still young, but doing the full time, can't go that way dogs, it was super muddy, oh boy, oh right, yeah, I saw there was a game on, I could hear it, that explains that situation then. I could hear a game on whilst I was down there. And I was like, yeah. They're playing a bit late, aren't they? But seeing a tour, a tour van kind of explains it. I tell you what's mad. The view you get from up here. I know it's dark and it's night time. But you still get a nice view. And I think also what's going to do it for me it's tomorrow, my dad is going to, oh god, choking. Let me get my breath back first. My dad's going to drop me off in Huddersfield. So I'm going to have a bit of time in Huddersfield. But I'm also going to get a bus to Almondbury direction. Because that is where Castle Hill is. What is that? It's just a random bag. Okay, oh, that's it. Right, we need to cross over. Because even though it's nine o'clock in the evening, it's still busy. And I text my dad saying, look, I'll meet you here. And that's what we're doing. We haven't done it in a very long time. But again, once again, going to, a, going to a cemetery in the dark, especially when you've got the chills, it's a bit freaky. So I'm gonna stop here, stop the recording. Uh, I'm gonna see where my dad is and just wait for him, pretty much. Unless, unless my dogs have other ideas. Nope. <laughs> Anyway, thanks for watching for now. I'm just curious now if this is going to be wet or not. I know it's rained. Yeah, what do you think? It's wet. <laughs> I will walk. I shall go somewhere that's good and visible for him to see me. Just around here is good, actually. Pretty much. Anyway, thanks for watching for now, uh, and uh, goodbye.